Each year, 700,000 Americans have their gallbladders removed due to gallstone disease. Cholesterol-lowering drugs called statins may decrease the risk of disease and surgery, which follows. Statins actually act in the liver. And um, in doing so, they reduce uh, the cholesterol formation in liver. And this transforms to lower blood levels of cholesterol, but maybe also of lower levels in the gallbladder. Statins are major weapons in the battle against heart disease and high cholesterol. It was a surprise they helped in gallbladder disease. Most doctors diagnose gallbladder disease on physical exam, but then you need special tests. The next step is to look at the gallbladder and special transport areas in the body called the bile ducts. The most popular test is the ultrasound. Ultrasound allows us to see the gallbladder real well. It allows us to see gallstones very well. Um, and if there's any abnormalities of the gallbladder, such as it's inflamed, there's specific ways we can tell it's in inflamed. So uh, it's a very good method to look at the gallbladder. Of course, most people would rather not get to the point of needing any scans or suffering gallbladder pain. Researchers also studied how long a patient needed to take statins before this risk was reduced. What we found is about you have to take one or one and a half years of statin therapy to have um, an association with a lower risk of um, gallbladder disease followed by um, gallbladder removal. I'm Dr. Brian McDonough.